Hey loves, you're welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to the amazing finished supermarket, guys. So I came across a supermarket here on YouTube and I'm like, oh no, I need to bring it to your doorstep, like right to your screen, right? So this is um amazing. This is um incredible. Like this is finished supermarket, guys. So you guys need to see this and watch this yourself. So if you're new here and leave your friends reacting, you're welcome to my channel. I'm going to do introduction after uh, reacting to this video. So without further ado, I'm wasting too much of our time. Let's get right into this video, okay? There's also an exotic fruit section with some fruits I've never seen before. Pretty cool if you ask me. And all fresh as can be. It's a very, very high quality store. There's even a salad bar, which is pretty amazing. The Salat de Bari. For 15 euros almost, you have a kilo. So that's 149 for 100 grams. I got some seeds, some Doritos on top. Uh, tuna, carrot, onion. Some falafels, even cheese toppings, and the actual salad. There's fruits. There's everything for a healthy little snack. Absolutely amazing. You can disinfect your hands and just pile on in your salad box. What a marvelous store, guys. As fresh as can be. The habanero peppers. This tops any supermarket I've ever seen in any country. It's absolutely gorgeous. This Finnish supermarket is in uh, Jyväskylä, which is in central Finland. And um, it's one of the biggest ones in the town. It's essentially in the city mall. And what you see is that everything is pretty much fresh and you can just take um, whatever you need basically straight from the field. It arrives in a box. It's put right here and you can just uh, take a bow and go straight home and cook a very fresh nice meal for yourself prices are a bit higher obviously than in Bulgaria although it's nothing outrageous um, compared to the the salary most mostly and then definitely it's uh, it's a decent price but if we compare it to 
the Bulgarian standard, it would be, well, quite a difference, obviously. It's nowhere comparable. They essentially have everything ranging from household products to and gardening, you have the magazines, um, comics, obviously, uh, you have food stuff, you have uh, products for pets, strawberries currently in May 2022 are 550 for 400 grams, which is basically the same price as Bulgaria in this season, where these strawberries are also quite expensive this time of year everything for food um, it's a bit more American in terms of size so you have paper in bigger packages everything is just a bit bigger and that means essentially you get a wholesale price as well where it's a little bit lower uh, depending on how much you buy for example this is well kitchen household towels and the normal toilet paper is becoming more expensive because I don't know I read it uh, the current crisis let's say or some made-up excuse it's not very cheap as you can see you pay 7 15 for a batch of toilet paper which is quite expensive here you find wholesale as well where you can get 32 rolls or what is it 24 and it would cost you 31 cents a piece which is relatively affordable again not not much of a difference compared to Bulgaria for example especially if we take into account the income what else do we have clothes shoes um, everything you can imagine There's even dressing rooms, there's toilets. Um, it's the closest we get in Europe to a Walmart, essentially. Just with decent looking people around as compared to the US. Bag, shoes, it just doesn't end essentially. We have sports goods and we get to the bikes, home trainers, outdoor products such as sleeping bags. Because Finland obviously is a huge outdoor destination and people themselves do a lot of nature. Uh, hiking, fishing, everything you can imagine. So you do need all of these products as well that you find right here. A uh, raft even. Um, then you get your TVs, your coffee machines. So essentially it's a technopolis as well that we would have in Bulgaria where you can get an air conditioning system. Um, A flat screen TV, things for remote working, a microphone, a webcam, it's all in one. What's interesting is that, well, essentially this is a supermarket, but you have lamps as well. Lamps right here. Um, what I wanted to show you is just that it doesn't end. You have it all and for Europe, this is a pretty uh, impressive type of store because rarely do we see it all in one. But Finland is a little bit American in that sense that uh, it's catered to convenience. Uh, part of that taking into account that distances in Finland are pretty uh, big. So if you go to the city and you live in some rural area, you go to the city and you do it all at once. Uh, it's the IKEA in here, it's the hardware store, it's your outdoor store, 
you can get your toilet paper, you can get your food, and you take your big car home. That's the the thing in Finland. And it's actually quite cool, if you ask me. I like it. Uh, that's it for now. All right? Take care. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video with me. Now, I love the supermarket. It's so big. It's so elaborate. It's so, oh my God, it's so broad and wide. And everything were encapsulated inside the supermarket. There's nothing you cannot see right in the supermarket. There were bicycles. There were fruits. There were grocery. A whole lot of things. Like, I really love the supermarket. It's a place you can just go in and shop whatever you want to shop, right? So, um, this is so amazing. Finnish supermarket did extremely well. I love everything about this content i want you guys to rate it on a scale of 100 what do you think about this video what do you think about the supermarket right rate them on a scale of 100 right so thank you so much for watching if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for always tuning in if you're a new subscriber this is bibi hairfuss react where we react to trending music trending views trending updates happening all over the world if this might interest you you might consider subscribing to our channel guys okay we've come to the end of today's video i love you guys so so much um don't go too far trust me i'll be right back and i'll see you in my next video bye